What is happening, my Android friends? Welcome to another episode of Device Updates. I am David, of course, your Android junkie at AndroidSpin.com. We're going to be looking at some updates between the dates of December 2nd to today, December 9th. Hopefully today. I don't know when I'm getting this video up, but hey, let's get started. Android 4.4.2 already? Wow, look at Google. They are really on top of things. Is Google starting to release nightlies? Hopefully not. But yes, you can download Android 4.4.2 on all of your Nexus devices. They have the download for the Nexus 4, the Nexus 5, the Nexus 7, and the Nexus 10. And we have all the downloads for you just in case you missed it. I know some of you are probably still waiting for that Android 4.4.1 update. You know, especially if you're rooted, you didn't want to use ADB to sideload it onto your device. But hey, you know, what can you do? So if you already have that update on your device and you want to get Android 4.4.2, click the link down below in the description and let me know how it is. And it looks like the Moto X has seen a nice little update, I guess, after the Android 4.4 KitKat update that was released to the Moto X on all carriers. People were saying that the active display was a little laggy. There were some bugs within that. So Motorola took it upon themselves to update the active display app in the Play Store. So if you want to just update that portion of your Moto X, go into the Play Store, update active display, and you will be fine. Motorola also silently updated the Moto X by giving you a festive boot animation that, you know, has to go with uh, Christmas into the winter season. Yes, you will get a new boot animation that shows, you know, some cool little festive Christmassy-like animations. The animation is supposed to take hold on December 10th, which is tomorrow or, well, in a couple of hours, really. So if you see that boot animation once you reboot your phone, don't get scared. It's just Motorola secretly updating your phone. And now for you HTC Droid DNA users, your Android 4.2.2 and since 5 update is coming in the first quarter of 2014. HTC is trying to update their phones and there is even a rumor not too long ago that said that they were going to get the HTC Droid DNA to Android 4.4 at the end of January. So if that update starts rolling out, we will surely let you know. But keep an eye out in the beginning of 2014 for that Android 4.2.2 update. And now to your Galaxy Note 2 users, it seems like the T-Mobile version has started receiving its Android 4.3 update as well as some of the other versions. Now a lot of you with a Note 2 probably already updated to Android 4.3 since there's many ROMs out there and or you could just sideload it on your device. But for those of you that aren't rooted and are waiting, well, T-Mobile version is getting it but not everyone is getting it so we will see what happens. Hopefully they get that update to you. Anything we find out, we will surely let you know. And it seems that Samsung has released yet another document about updates, and this time it's all their mid-range phones receiving Android 4.4. Now I'm talking about the S4 Mini, the S3 Mini, the Ace, the Advance, all these mid-range phones that you wouldn't think they would even consider getting Android 4.4, but we know that Android 4.4 is supposed to cut down that fragmentation. So if the mid-range devices are getting this Android 4.4 update, that just means the high-end devices will receive Android 4.4. We will let you know when those updates start rolling out. Well, all right, guys, that's all the updates I had for you this week. Make sure you hit that like, thumbs up button if you like this video, and subscribe to the Android Spin channel if you have not already. Well, I am David, your Android junkie over at AndroidSpin.com, and this has been Device Updates. Hopefully you've been updated. Some of you probably not. Some of you are probably upset. It's okay. You'll get there sooner or later. All right, guys. Talk to you later.